It's Friday. That means date night. For those of you who are new to my blog, every Friday I post a new date idea, creative date, from my book entitled 101 Creative Dates. So I published this book back in uh, February for Valentine's Day, and it's a book that I've been working on for quite a long time, um, probably about 14 years it took me to finally get it published. And uh, it's really fun. I was, I'm just really excited to share these ideas with you. I think as a society, especially in the dating world, we kind of uh, default to dinner and a movie or Netflix and chill. And uh, I think it's awesome once in a while to spice up your dating life and do something creative, do something different, something out of the ordinary that you might not do all the time. So what I decided to do was to post those uh, each date every Friday. You can also buy the book if you like. I'll drop a link down below where you can find the book in case you want to pick up like the, the paperback or the, um, the ebook version. So that brings us to date number 30. Get your extreme sports on. So what do I mean by that? So here in Phoenix, and I'm sure there's other big cities around the world that have a, what they call like an extreme sports center or extreme fun center or some kind of a fun center where when you go there, there's all kinds of cool activities to do. Uh, for example, one that I went to had like sumo wrestling. You get inside like this a blown up uh, sumo suit and you do sumo wrestling. They, they also had like a giant kid's um, bouncy house um, with like little slides and all kinds of things like that. Um, they also had um, trampolines, uh, things like that. So it's just a really fun place, out of the ordinary, kind of like where big kids can go to have fun, you know? And uh, so that's, this whole date is centered around finding one of those locations and taking a group there, uh, a, make it a group date. It could just be um, you and your spouse, you and your uh, significant other, whatever you like to do. And it's just a really fun time to try some wacky sports. And uh, maybe you wanna take your phone out and film it, you know, provide a, provide a few laughs for later on, capture the moment for posterity, or maybe even do a post about it. I don't know. So there you go, that kind of sums up this date activity. If you wanna find out my experience with it, make sure to read the whole post down below. Happy dating, everyone. Until next time, I am Matt Taylor, signing off.